on the drive here on hole and number um hole and number six this is option number one we have uh, um, very similar type of drive here on option one and option two. We are pushing this one hard to attack for an albatross. All the top spin to right spin stretch out to max with our blue ring by the rough with the rock. And uh, once we have done that, we swap to a POC, adjust max plus 20p0. And then we're gonna push up the same amount of rings with a POC 7 as a POC 8. This is due to the POC 7's slightly lesser top spin. And we do want somewhere uh, be somewhere between 444 and 450 yards so we have pushed up we're gonna go half a ball of curl to the right and make sure it is perfect this is a play for a p5 win three side spin four ball because we do need a lot of side spin on the approach and the thing that is the good thing with this is that we're not hitting a perfect ball on the approach so you don't have to depend on you know having a great ball with a non-precision ball, for an example. We're going for an albatross with this uh, option, uh, even though it's gonna be a very big bonus if it drops. On the second shot, now we're going to make sure that the ball guide line is straight with our center line. Not the tip, but the ball guide line. And once that is done, we are then moving so the, ball, the reminder of the ball guide is going through that uh, that red sign that is there in the rough and once we have found that spot we're going to have a look at the wind angles and then uh, add whatever spins this is the blue angle and in here we have noted down that we are going to use yeah let's see where do i have blue 0 0.3 top spin and 3.3 .3 right spin which is a little bit more than the thing that we do have in the video but we're also burning the edge on the left hand side this is a power shot so be aware with this type of shot that first and foremost if you don't release on a uh, on um, on the hook or on the slice i don't even remember what it's called but if you're not releasing on that and you're releasing a perfect ball then you're gonna fly right into the rough and with this type of play it is obviously important with the details but if you do feel that there's too much on the slide then you can always use the middling value there and you will always be on green somewhere but the plan with this type of play is to give ourselves a solid look at the not solid but give us a look at the albatross but obviously a drop here is going to be a massive bonus